All right. We're just basically running the top three Pokemon in the meta. Top, we're running three of the top four. Screw it. Let's see if it goes any better for us. Let's see if it goes any better for us. Let's see if we can continue to play somewhat clean. That last set had some ups and downs when it came to our, our play patterns as well. So let's see if we can play a little better. Uh, we got a Florgis and a Pangoro. Unexpected, but also we're pretty happy to uh, see this pairing. Okay. I'm fine with this. Because I'm pretty sure we're out we're gonna outpace them for the most part. I guess they could double bait me. Which might be their play pattern here. At this point, it feels like uh Screw it. No. It also could be that they were planning to double rock wrecker me. <laughs> right? Uh, all right, we'll come in. We'll come in here and that they just get to the two rock wreckers. Unfortunately, without uh, without what's it called? This is a this is a greedy farm down that I don't think is going to work out for us, but we're gonna we're gonna go for it. Um. I have to imagine they've got another fairy counter too, which is the thing I'm worried about now. Like a good fairy counter in the back. Yeah, like what's their good fairy counter in the back? That's not that good a fairy counter. They just don't really have a floor just counter. We got the attack drop on Moonblast. That's pretty cool. All right, cheers, Matthew. Have a good one, friend. How do we, how do we, how do we? Okay, I think we can just disarming voice now. I just have to make sure we don't accidentally die without putting on enough damage. Okay, yeah, we got the Moonblast. We should be fine. We should be fine. Kind of getting bailed out by team comp a little bit here. Our opponent just really didn't have an answer to floor just so. GG's. GG's. But it's good to know that uh, Gyarados doesn't necessarily beat Rhyperior all the time. What's Why does it PV Poke have this as such a big win? If you shield a breaking swipe... They can't get to a rock. I feel like this just is awkward, though. Huh. Because, like, they shielded both of my Aqua Tails and got to two Rock Wreckers. After the, after the bait. So I don't actually know that that... I don't know that the, the PV Poke Sim is terribly good there. I mean, they have to shield the first move. I'm gonna have to shield all your moves. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to look at that one a little later. We'll have to look at that one a little later and see. Uh, guard chomp. I'm okay with that. We got a couple. Actually, our whole team's pretty good into guard chomp. <laughs> so if anything, we kind of want them to. Uh, we kind of want them to switch because our whole team is good into this. So I'd rather if they want to fight floor just with their guard chomp, that feels pretty bad for them. Which probably means Florgis is pretty good for them, which means we should probably switch. But I don't even know that I I'm gonna I'm gonna do it after we get a shield here. Mm. 
I'll give you one here. Yeah, we'll shield an outrage. I feel okay about that. Okay. Are they triple dragon? Like, what is what is the scenario where they're just like, yeah, we just have to do whatever we can against uh, against Florges. I mean, I'm not shielding anymore. But I feel like you don't you don't switch out of the uh, you don't stay in the Florges uh, Garchomp matchup unless you don't have terribly many other options, right? Okay, so they're shielding now. That's interesting. Oh no, we died. We died. I mean, a superpower from here actually does hurt. I'm still going to just take it because I feel like I've got a chance of winning this no matter what, but... I don't love this. This is obviously bad for us. <laughs> this is obviously really bad for us. I don't necessarily know how we win from here. The Metagross in the back is uh, a real bummer for us. We're just going to have to hope. There we go. Okay, they'll concede. And then we just go Aqua Tail, Aqua Tail, Aqua Tail. Disarming voice and hope we win. It's it's going to be messy. So they were they only had the one floor just counter. Huh? Huh? Excadrill. Uh, I don't love that. Right, that's not a, uh, we're gonna just go, we'll go here as our quote unquote safe swap. Okay. Oh, they're on charm, come on. Charm ain't, charm ain't right. Charm ain't right, what are you doing? Ugh. Okay. Charm's real, charm's actually pretty good into us though. As it, it makes it a, uh, it does make it a Gyarados counter. Do I want to shield here? I think I do because I just want to get either another shield or just some damage in, right? Yeah, I'll take the damage. I think that's fine. I think what we do here is we eat the hydro cannon and just get as much energy as possible. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, bullshit. Well, that didn't work out for me. That didn't work out for me at all. All right, so. What's reality here? That we're gonna have to try and shield rock slides, I guess. Reality here is we're losing. It doesn't matter. <laughs> there isn't a win condition for us. Okay, GG, it's fine, fine. That was, uh, that was unfortunate. I mean, we're not well prepared. I guess we were a little soft to opposing Florges, I'm now realizing, given that our only real answer to Florges is our own, and that's in the lead. So if we if there's a Florges in the back, it's kind of just core breaking us. Right? It's all right, Wildcat. GG's friend. It happens. Also, like, this is this is pretty poor for us. But we're just gonna we're just gonna go. And hope that maybe our opponent doesn't have a strong play here. No. 
<laughs> no, nah, you were all right. I just, I didn't, I just didn't have an answer for it in the back, and I, I got greedy and tried my best to find my, my way into it. But that was just a really, really tough. That was a really tough place to be. I think we're gonna. Tr we need a lot to go our way here. So, oh, they crunched me. Okay, I was like, if they aqua tail me and I survive, maybe we have a chance. But we're currently looking at a scenario where I have Dragon Breath Gyarados into Magna Zone, and that is not really a winning combo. Now, the Gary doesn't do much to us here, so I'd love to come out of this with some energy. In fact, we're going to just go now. I know this is feeling a little crazy, but I'm hoping to get the Magna Zone back in. And maybe either get rid of its shield or somehow kill it. And then we have to hope that we've got either a core break or something going on. Like at this point. We should CMP here, so we shield this. This should be CMP, right? This dies. Right. Okay. Oh, they got a mirror shot debuff? Oh, that's stupid. That's going to be bad. Okay, and then what? We know they have a Gyarados. Am I shielding this like an Aqua Tail from a Gyarados? I don't think I am. I think there's too many scenarios where... I think we have to Moonblast. I don't think it does. I don't think it's Army Voice kills him. Okay. Chestnut. Um, huh. Yeah, and then <laughs> woof. That'll do it. GG's. Ooh. Oh boy, was that, was that a bit of a, a puckerer? Mmm, 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 all right, all right, one more. <laughs> Thanks, Athras. That's good, that's good, I like that, I like that. All right, Jankill, good luck. One more. What do we got? Florgis and a Primarina. I do think I'm slightly favored here just on. On merits of being a slightly better Pokemon. I also now realize without the Rhyperior on my team, nothing is best buddied. I probably need to fix that again. Okay, a shield, sure. Oh, I probably uh, this is this is telegraphed, so my opponent's not going to shield this. I don't know why I'm throwing it necessarily, because two of these will kill him. But I have double hydro cannon. I mean, they went a lot of energy here. Oh, I see. Good catch. Good catch. Good catch. I don't love wasting this energy into Metagross. We do get to put something on Metagross. That's pretty effective into it, but. This could also very well be baiting out our Gyarados, right? Yeah, they're not, they're not interested in that fight, but the Gyarados is out now. Primarina gets to come in and do some damage to it. Oh, the Primarina is fairly low, so like 
this is fine. We technically have another borderline water Pokemon too. So, you know, we're gonna just kind of have to hope that our, uh, yeah, they're gonna throw two of those, right? Oh, well, if they're throwing another one, they're gonna have to use a shield to do it. Nope, they're not going to. Hey, it's our old friend Excadrill. It's our old friend Exki. Okay, so they're gonna let that go. Fascinating. I mean, they're pretty low. <laughs> like, I don't really know what their game plan is. Our game plan is just to fast move through them, right? We're gonna let that die. Then we'll come in here and we'll keep going, right? You're not gonna you're not gonna kill me before uh before you die here. Or more to the point, you're not gonna be able to kill this before you die to dragon breaths. Right? I'm just I'm just tap tap tapping 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 away to a victory. GG's. <laughs> it's dead. We'll just both keep a shield. Keep the shield in the pocket. We don't need those. We don't need those. GG's. All right. That one's a little better. A little bit better. 